Do we have the right to control the world? Do we have a right to dominate it? Do other life forms matter? I think it's extremely arrogant and short-sighted for us to create such a huge meat industry at the expense of nature. These people came with their domesticated animals and they brought with them the image of the wolf as an evil creature. There have been a lot of stories in literature making out that wolves are the big bad beast. It's propaganda in so many cases by people who really hate wolves. They are the most malign creature ever with entire cultures demonization centered around their history. The wolf is a real challenge. It's a real challenge for us, I think, because there's a long history of mistrust, a human history of mistrust. Human wildlife conflicts are usually about human-human conflicts, but they focus on an animal. You know, the wolf issue became an issue about politics and not science. The objective was to kill them all off, and that was the policy for centuries. The protection on it just doesn't seem to be a priority compared to other species. One thing we have to acknowledge is how much of a part of our lives wolves already are. They've had a great impact on our culture, on our language, and their absence is having an impact on our physical landscape. The United Kingdom, though it looks very, very green from the sky, is incredibly barren. Are we just going to use the world as our taking and convert all the land to agriculture and farmland to raise animals, or we are going to share it with other creatures? There's something there that's very ancient, very precious when it comes to our relationship with a wolf.